I, I don't know what I want to do as an intro. I completely <laughs> flopped that. I, I just sort of looked at the camera and then I was like, I don't know what I'm going to say. I've just been focusing <laughs> on starting it today. And then I never even thought of what I was going to do. I, I don't know. This is the Gamer Jets Duo start- Podcast. We awesome. This is the second one. We do it every week. We talk about movies and shows and games and stuff. And uh, uh, food sometimes. Yeah. Sometimes yeah, food. food. Like eggnog. Yeah, yeah, right there. That's, yeah, quality. That, this is the uh, seasonal food for uh, this season. <laughs> the seasonal uh, food for this turkey, season. Yeah. Se- uh, eggnog and pumpkin spice. Pumpkin. There. Anything with pumpkins. Yeah, in anything it. pumpkin. So yeah, welcome, welcome to that thing that we're doing right now. So yeah, yeah. So we just we just came from watching the Walking Dead mid-season finale. Like five minutes after. <laughs> yeah, we just started it. So, okay, you know how on Facebook, or on IGN, they had a post that was interviewing Robert Kirkman, and he said that you will be very surprised at the mid-season finale. And I was like, honestly, the only thing that could have surprised me is if the deal, well, spoilers, by the way, if the deal went off without a hitch, no one died, and they walked away. That would have been surprising, and I... And I, yeah, it, been okay. I was like, wow, I didn't thing, see that coming. Oh, the, my gosh. But the part, nah, it happened. We should have registered something when Beth picked up the, the scissors. Oh, I, we I registered that. I knew, dude. That That's what I'm saying. I wasn't shocked. I was like, I was like, uh, okay, and then I they're starting to wait. The, like, when they it, exchanged the two people, they started to walk away. And I was like, all right, here it comes. <laughs> and yeah, freaking, I, knew, I, knew, I knew that. Like, and then, gonna, yeah, oh. and then the uh, Dawn was like. And now we just need Noah. And I'm like, okay, yeah. Yeah, that was that was what we were waiting for. By the way, my beard is coming in, like, way yeah, more than last year. Like, the still spots still right here actually have hair. Or slowly <laughs> getting hair. So, <laughs> on, I think I'm going to keep it going through December. I'm going to really? trim it and keep right. it going. Because the thing is, is, I always see how much I can grow the next year, like, in November. But I don't... No, that's it. I normally just yeah. see how much I can grow in a month, and then I don't ever try again. Try yeah. more. What if you can? What if you can buy? What if you can get off with a um, Calhoun beard? <laughs> oh gosh, that would be amazing. Calhoun's the yeah. best, dude. Also, we need to talk about that. Well, I don't know. Let's yeah. let's continue with the Walking Dead, and then we can yeah. we can talk about yeah. video game high school finale yeah. because that happened a while back, but we yeah. haven't <laughs> been able to talk about it. <laughs> So the Walking Dead, I don't know. Name name your favorite moment because there were good moments even with the sadness okay. at the end. Here's my thing with it. Um Maggie finally cared about her sister <laughs> once. See, that the you best... guys were both very confused about that. I I think it's perfectly logical. Well, I mean, I think it's logical yeah. because she was, it wasn't on her mind really and she was no, just on her The mission, thing is but... is that she got took. She got taken. I guess, as you can see, yes. Liam Neeson. But uh, yeah, Liam. <laughs> just throwing that. I don't know. I don't know. I haven't seen those movies, so I ha- I can't give a good You're reference right. there. But um, yeah. yeah. So she got taken. So I assume that Maggie automatically just assumed when uh Beth got when she heard that Beth got taken, she got taken by the Terminus so people, much. eaten and dead. So yeah. she just didn't worry about it. She, like, when she's gone. That she was dead. <laughs> yeah. Taken like, usually oh means gosh, yes. dead. <laughs> and then, oh my gosh, no! <laughs> Why did it have to be that quick? They could have... I mean, she could have... <sighs> See, I don't really understand like, oh, because yeah. I don't really... I I wasn't freaking out like you and Andrew. I For some weird reason. I know I like Beth as a character, but I, I didn't personally like Beth that much like I didn't feel much of a connection with her like with any of the other characters like Like, I feel more of a connection with Rosita than I do with Beth I don't know why I don't know why I just don't I didn't feel anything for Beth I she felt really stale the whole time but that's me I don't know why that is either ever since she's been taken her focus was put on a lot more and I started to like her a lot yeah I mean I I do I mean I'd like to say that I like her because I can I note that she's a good character, but I just for some reason I I don't have any emotions towards Beth 
good, bad. But seriously, that whole thing. But that was sad at the end, so I guess that's something. <laughs> like, I was sitting there like, but the shit, thinking about this, I wasn't, I, the um, intensity wasn't like way high where I was like in my seat, mm -hmm. sit, like, anticipating anything. I was kind of like just laid back like, what's happening here? Are they going to, is Noah just going to go off with them? Is Noah going to get hurt or something? I and liked then, that they stood up for Noah, then, too. Then I saw freaking Beth make a move. I was like, oh, I jumped, and then no. boom. And, boom. As and soon now I just as... start freaking out. No. My phone. <laughs> I noticed as soon as Beth uh, walked up and said, now I see what you mean, and, like, mm. looked her deep in her eyes. I forgot about the knife, I knew though. that was coming. So that, that's why I, I didn't know. Was. Oh yeah, well I I took note. She freaking slid scissors up her cast. Yeah, they're definitely going on with something there. But uh, I I really did like that they stood up for Noah. Mm -hmm. I I thought that was awesome. Even Daryl was like, no, you're not taking this kid. And I I, I don't know. I really liked the whole episode. It it was really good, just in general. The freaking yeah. uh, like when when Dawn was dead, they the girl on the other side was just like stop hold your fire it was yeah. all about her we don't care we have no qualms with you we're just chilling here just trying to survive you can stay if you want you can and then rick's like you can come with us if you want you guys and which also i thought i don't know they didn't from the previews of what's coming next season it didn't seem like any of them went with them no. but the way they shot it was made me allude to like they all sort of wanted to maybe maybe no, i just I think they i think they were just really upset with um dawn yeah they i don't way. know i don't know it is it is weird i guess i just read that wrong i but, was like this i was terrified of dawn really every time i saw her was, eyes were <sighs> yeah she was freaky <laughs> kill someone <laughs> it's freaky it is, yeah. oh, she's weird She's yeah. not as weird as the uh, alien, the alien woman in Arrow, Katana. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but um, okay. So I, I still want to know what was your favorite like moment in moment. the thing? Because I had one that wasn't specifically the ending, the shocker thing. I was watching all the way up and taking note um... of all the cool stuff that was happening. <laughs> oh my god, the beginning too. <laughs> I why can't I can't remember what happened in the beginning. Why can't I remember? Maybe you missed I, it. I, I've been. I might have. No, no, I didn't. Um, what happened? I actually forgot because I was just so. Well, so they the, the guy dude Lamson was running away and uh, Rick got it. in his car and yeah, yeah that was there that you was go. All. Okay, I just needed a friend. Okay, and then the the big thing that happened after that was the fight scene. Do you mm -hmm. remember that? Okay, okay. What was the next I, cool I, I scene like... after that? I That's like the fight. That was, I okay. think that was my favorite. All right. I'm not going to try and pull more info out of you then. <laughs> and I, also, I also liked um, Morgan getting closer. Just the fact that he's getting closer to the team. That's also a cool thing. Like he's like, he, he saw the paper, you know. Wait, did, did you read out there? You didn't watch the full episode, mate. You're calling me. Okay, wait, first of all, first of all, how long was this clip of Morgan that was apparently in this episode? How long was it? Like 20 seconds? No, like five minutes. I watched the whole thing, dude. I watched the whole thing. Maybe I came back no, from a No, after the credits, there was like, not five Previous. minutes, but like maybe two or three minutes of, did you not watch after the credits? They, no, no, I did not. No, I watched Holy the crap, preview okay. and then I left because that never happens. Yeah, and, okay. I was on Story Sync and it said this, this, the episodes are over. Keep watching. Oh, well, I wasn't. And then pretty much all it was was Morgan in the church, and he picked up a piece of paper that said Rick Grimes on it. Well, that's really cool. Awesome. So he's clo he's getting close. <laughs> I was I was very confused you're, though. You're... I was like, how do you not remember any of you're... the episode other than the ending? And then you pull out this obscure thing that th so <laughs> you remember the ending and after the credits, <laughs> but I remember the whole episode except for after the credits. But uh, my my without a doubt favorite part, which I still I'm not sure if you remember this, 
the the best part other than the ending which i don't I know like if the this, ending they're all sniping right? yeah that they're that was the best sniping. for me the yeah, uh how really close intense. are your people and then <laughs> and the guy's like they're pretty close <laughs> or they're really yeah. close or something like that and he says it so calmly it's, it's great it's great but um then the <laughs> the beginning part when lamson got run over mm. <laughs> Dude, I couldn't stop laughing. It was hilarious to me. He was like, It was oh, so God. funny. Because <laughs> he was running and Rick's just Why? like chilling Why in his car and he's run? like, Stop. Just just stop. Uh, and it's over. Just stop. All right. Let's <laughs> keep running. <laughs> and then he gets out of the, and I, Like he was laying on the floor and I thought it was just like an insta death, but then he goes up to him. But I was laughing so hard when he was just like, Floors it, hits the guy. And I was <laughs> like, that's so great. Lampson was a stupid character. He was so stupid. I don't. I didn't understand but that. It was great. It's like, okay, you could get handed over back to your people alive and not with a broken back, or you could die with a broken back. <laughs> get shot in the head. You know what? Yeah, <laughs> the I, logic was completely I, freaking, flawed. There, he's so. like. <laughs> The ending part was great too. Rick's just like, shut up. <laughs> yeah, and he's like, shut up. amazing. It's amazing. I love how far Rick has come. It's so awesome. Yeah. I'm getting like really red because I'm like so excited about this. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, it's gonna be. I don't know. It's great. And freaking now we have to wait until February. What? February. 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 A long time mid-season finale which i don't understand why they keep doing, doing that this. Stop doing but it. i'm happy because they showed a teaser for better call saw which is a spin-off of breaking bad which is amazing and it was funny all right was, all right nice yeah, yeah that's cool i got I no happy. input for that yeah <laughs> i was just gonna nod yeah and lots of the commercials were lots of games. Oh, dude, that happens every week, and it makes me really happy. But yeah. uh, I I told Andrew this, or I no, I didn't tell Andrew this. I tweeted this. What am I talking about? Why in the world do they show the, the original yeah. original Destiny ad instead of the Dark Below? When Warlords of Draenor is coming out, they show Warlords of Draenor ads. They don't yeah, show sure. the original World of Warcraft ad from like ten years ago. I I know that's okay, a different comparison, first, but still, come on. Yeah, it's still the first year. Of yeah, the game. but I mean, like for people who have been playing the game, it's the same exposure. It, like it's the same exposure sure, to people who haven't been playing it. They get to see at the end. Oh, Destiny! People that looks pretty cool. There's people need to know that there's more. So. Yeah, and and. I'm just saying for like people who enjoy the uh, who are consistently playing the game, it'd be awesome. So while I'm sitting down and watching The Walking Dead, I, I see, see the Crota. dark below and I'm just like, I can't wait. It's like probably how World of Warcraft fans felt when they saw Warlords of Draenor's commercial. Which is level 90, and you see that. <laughs> but yeah, yeah, that's the part when they get upset though. They see, oh, that's an awesome cinematic that boosts the level 9. Gosh dang it, I wish they never put that in. No. But, uh, <laughs> Yeah, also, I just realized that we've been going for, like, 13 minutes, and we haven't even talked about what we've been playing or watching or anything. It's yeah. obvious. You know, I'm not even going to go over what we've been watching. It, it's uh, it, We're going to talk watched, about it. I watched Doctor Who. Oh, I, nice. I finished it. Nice. It's really weird. <laughs> That's not Like, weird. you're like, when you finish it, you're going to be like, yeah, this is awesome. Like, that's genuine. that was genuine. But at the same time, you're like, what? Like, you're really confused because this and that and that. And they just throw Dr. things at you. Human. And there's this really cool thing um, that the humans hmm. label the doctor, uh, which will be kind of... I was like, whoa, really? That's awesome. So. Interesting. Interesting. So, yeah. But, uh, yeah, I'll have to watch that. But I'm not even going to say what, we're, what else we're watching because it'll probably become very obvious because of our topics. Well, but, um... Next week we can talk about what we've been. Flash. No, we're we're still talking about that. Oh well, yeah, we'll talk about the crossover, like what happened next yeah. week. But this week we're going to talk about, you know, it going up to it. It you know? okay. Yeah, it. If you if you know what I'm saying. But um. Get shot. <laughs> <laughs> God dang it. But uh, we what have uh, we been playing? 
Many things. Ice that, cream. Not Blizzard really. Pie. Not many things. <laughs> Monely, m- Monely? Monely? That was a mix of Whoa. mainly and mostly. <laughs> Monely? We've been playing Monely Destiny. Yeah, we've Mace- been like hardcore grinding. I just mixed it again. I said mostly. <laughs> So it's mostly Ma- and mostly apparently mainly, <laughs> mainly mostly. And mostly yeah okay we've been mainly playing destiny there we yeah. go we've all been really excited for the dark blow so we've i don't know we we got, we got addicted again that's pretty much it we got addicted again like yeah i i have like i've already in the past like week i've logged like uh 20 or 30 more hours into the game mm-hmm. So it's easy to do that with your dailies, weeklies. And yeah, and plus, raids. since I'm yeah. doing other characters now as well, that makes it a little bit easier. And now we're doing hard raids, so yeah, even more time. Tune coming. in on uh, Tuesday to see us yeah, do Tuesday, normal raids. Twitch, TBCEC. <laughs> yeah, TBCEC games, son. So, uh, bro, what what do you want to talk about? Um, Star Wars. Star Wars. That Star Wars trailer, though. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Everyone's talking about this, the lightsaber and the refrigerator. That's awesome. The refrigerator speeder. <laughs> We're <laughs> calling it a refrigerator. Dude, my best. The the thing that I don't. I used to be a huge, huge, huge Star Wars fan, but the thing is, is now, I noticed so many inconsistencies and stuff in that universe that I decided to stop investing all my time into looking into that universe more. But mm-hmm. I still like it. So seeing right. freaking the best thing that I'm – the thing that I'm most excited for about that movie is seeing all those – seeing, like, classic Star Wars things with the insane visuals. <laughs> yeah, That's true. the true. thing. Like, the Stormtroopers, the best – Probably my favorite part of that was the stormtroopers on the ship, or yeah, the no, 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 the 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 X-wings. I don't know, X-wings, yeah, the X-wings yeah. going water. across over the water <laughs> with the mountains in the back, like yeah. the, like you remember how the X-wings used to look, and they still looked mm-hmm. fine, but now it's X-wings over the water with the water splashing and the particle effects and the fog in the background with the mountains, and it's just insane. Like Seriously. I can't wait to see that. The part where like you, it's like goes goes black. And then you hear the old classical music, and then you hear, you see the Millennium Falcon just pop out of nowhere. The Millennium Falcon hasn't been on screen, like a new footage of it, haven't been on screen since like the 80s. So see, that's... The, see, I wasn't as excited about that because it, I mean, it, uh-huh. it, it looked for the, it looked like the Millennium Falcon. I don't know. It, it looked more colorful. I'll say that. Well, I mean, it's special because it hasn't. There hasn't been any new, new footage of it since well yeah it's never been on screen since so i guess but the the thing is people who are excited about the star wars movie now were people that literally like i don't know a a year or two ago before disney bought it and announced that they were making star wars 7 um before that they were saying never touch star wars ever again it's perfect don't touch the films and now they're all super excited so it's like I don't know. I was never that. I was like, yes, more Star Wars movies. So, so. Uh, no, I, I was not. I was like, continue Star Wars and other stuff. I don't. And but now that the movie is coming out, I'm just sort of like, I'm not like insanely pumped, but I'm gonna go see it, and it's gonna yeah. be awesome. But yeah, like like I said, that freaking stormtrooper ship. I, and, I love the like, helmets. The, um, it has like you know the black visor type thing. Yeah, it like goes down the sides now. Yeah, and, uh, I guess it, it, you might not see it well that well, but it's awesome. That's seriously the thing that I'm most excited about in this movie is the fact that it just it all looks so good now. Yeah. Like, I mean, it looked fine back then, but it looks I don't like, know yeah. like modern movies, you know? I, right. I I didn't I, for some weird reason I didn't expect that, even though I know it's J.J. Right. Abrams and it's all this. But I just didn't really expect it. It was. It would be funny if they pulled a 45 FPS on Star Wars, <laughs> hmm. like a Hobbit. I don't know. They put I, it. At... I still don't have any opinion on that because I haven't seen the Hobbit in 40. Uh, I think it's 48 frames. But I um, it, and it's very yeah. weird. But, yeah. I would have loved to have seen it in 48. I would have loved to try that. But I 45, there's 48, there's no 
Mm. There's no theater around here that does yeah. that, or where I was that did that. Mm. So Christmas is coming up soon, mate. Yeah. Segue, just freaking segue from nothing. <laughs> segue out of mm-hmm. nothing, grabbing it out of the air. Um, grabbing the non-existent segue out of the air. Yeah. So as you see, we have Christmas lights. They're all up. Uh, you know, oh, wait, let me Shoot. let me get on my screen. Yeah, Eric's doing it. Yeah, they're right there. Oh, yeah, right above his hands, right there. So uh, yeah, we got Christmas lights. We're celebrating. Uh, if we had a jingle, if we had some sort of tune for our podcast, I would like make a Christmas version somehow and it would like fade in with us with the Christmas song playing. It'd be amazing. But that's, you know, it's never going to happen, but that's fine. That's fine. (laughs) Work. Yeah. (laughs) Lots of work and lots of work for someone that is not musically talented (laughs) at all. (laughs) I was saying if we somehow had like a unique theme. And we can make it into like a unique little Christmassy tune, then yeah. that would be awesome. But that's never gonna happen, <laughs> ever. So <laughs> Christmas is coming up, and I'm super excited because I freaking love Christmas. Christmas is my favorite holiday of every of every year. <laughs> so I, say I mean, that. you got you gotta give honor, honorable mentions to Thanksgiving for all the food, you know. Well, yeah, but I I still. <laughs> Definitely, but I Christmas isn't my favorite. It's just it, everyone's like so happy and they're all in everyone's in good moods and stuff. It's great. It's great. It's great. I love it. I love it. <laughs> so I'm. I just wanted to point out that we're starting the festivities here on my channel and on my Twitch channel. We're gonna yeah. pretty much all that means is that we have <laughs> we have Christmas lights. Yeah. That's pretty much it. But you know, it's something. Maybe you can play some Flash games that are based on Christmas. There you go. <laughs> I should. I should look that up. But was um, like, Santa, like taking. Yeah. Oh, I was gonna say something else, but I forgot it. What the frick was it? It was like Christmas. No, it was Christmas, but having to do with something other than Christmas. I don't know. I don't know. Anyways, so um, Ubisoft, mate. Yeah, Ubisoft. Ubisoft. Freaking. So we both know we played Unity. We played mm-hmm. AC Unity. It's. It was a good game, and it's still a good game. But it's it was tech Before technically <laughs> very broken <laughs> on day one, yep. and very very broken. Transform. Like normally when people talk about glitches and stuff, I never I had never like on a game and it's it makes me laugh cuz it's like I had never experienced that. Mm. But I experienced pretty much all of the ones listed. But yep. they're now I, I don't know. My the thing is is they they now initiated a like we sorry program. So like we're we're very okay. sorry uh, here if you the thing is is what they're doing is if we if the person had the season pass, you get one of Ubisoft's new yeah. games. You get a it's it's a really good selection. So you get a free game, a free sixty dollar game because you their game was broken. <laughs> yeah, I'm I'm probably gonna get the crew. But uh, if you didn't have the season pass, then you get um you get the the main DLC package for free. So that means I won't get the uh. I can't no. get like Far Cry. <laughs> no, <laughs> but you get the you get you actually do get to play the DLC for yeah. Unity though, which is which is pretty cool. I really do like that for them saying they're sorry. But what I also mm-hmm. wanted to hear, which don't quote me on this, I'm not sure if this is in the article. They, there's an article about all this, but I'm not I'm not sure if that's there. But I really just want them to say it's not gonna happen again. They probably said that, but yeah. I don't remember it. Like, they should say, if our game isn't finished next year, we won't release it. Just say that, well, and I'll be happy, I because swear, I don't want I this to happen again next year. Everyone is fine with waiting a little bit more yeah. for a fixed game. Yeah, It's not that hard. I mean, they could have waited till December to release it, and people were like, yeah, I got this game for Christmas, called Assassin's <laughs> Creed Unity. Yeah. And bug free? Yeah. You should I, buy it. Yeah. The thing is, is I mean, by Christmas it'll be, it'll be fixed now. Oh. So like, if they had just spent an extra month getting all these patches and stuff, because by now I haven't tested it, but they the patch for, uh, like, FPS drop and all that came out. So a lot of it is fixed now. But it's just like, that took a month. Why why not just yeah. take that month, 
and then when it's all out release the game i i don't know because they want money but in the end i think it would be more efficient to get money by waiting and releasing proper right. games proper games not with a voice crack <laughs> luckily far cry 4 didn't have like no far cry 4 fun. was really good on bugs yeah it was like nothing. There was some connection issues on like day one, and then it was fixed. Like I think the instantly. main thing why Far Cry didn't have that much problems is because they don't have to have like tons of like um, entities, like people and yeah. items on around, and then interactable things. See, the problem with Unity is that they didn't need to have it either, but they wanted to really badly, yeah. and they went for it, and it didn't they work. On screen, you know. Yeah, but it didn't work. Ubisoft. Also, uh, I don't know. I'm not. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna go on my rant about modern day story because I've accepted the fact that Assassin's Creed will never go back to the awesomeness, awesomeness that it used to be. I just gotta accept it and move on with my life. So they could have made Unity's really great if they just put a, put a person in there. Put the thing the I'm other, saying is yeah. Other... One, the things that I've always said is that it's easy to make it as awesome as it used to be. Yeah really easy you're right they could have just like given you a name yeah I if, we had, if our if our future person had a name i would have been okay with that if we saw like cutscenes. i would have been okay with that we don't have to move whatever i mean it'd be nice still. to be able to have gameplay in the future but still name initiate yeah good job initiate <laughs> every Mind time school. she said that i was just like Ugh, <laughs> stop it <laughs> stop calling me that Oh, just bring me back Desmond and I'll be happy. But that's never going to happen. So GG, anyways. We have resurrection. <laughs> so yeah, the plan that I... That is a thing, though. There's a, there's a piece of Eden that is... That oh, yeah. has that. What that's if they just, thing. like, say, like, hey... You know what? It would be stupid. I wouldn't even care. I would Point take it. Arno I'd be like, all right, awesome, let's go. I don't think he had that. I still, I still think he he should have been able to use the sword of Eden to resurrect. What's your face? <laughs> it's not the type of item, mate. <laughs> I don't care. <laughs> it's, imagine, like, say, you know, you have a bow that shoots arrows, and then you have yeah. a sword, and you're trying to shoot arrows with a sword. You know, <laughs> it's not gonna work. <laughs> okay, so I mean, I guess sword is destruction, and the apple is life. It's, or it's not. <laughs> it's not specifically the apple that does the the res thing. It's a piece of Eden. Okay. The Apple of Eden controls people's minds. Hmm. Yeah. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah. You use the Apple of Eden in three. Spoilers. Yeah. Oh, man. Oh, those older games, man. They're so good. They were leading up to some awesome stuff, and then it just... Uh, nope. Anyways, so what I was going <laughs> to do was have a... Uh, right there, the Avatar Aang poster mm -hmm. on frames, in a frame... It's going to look really good. It's going to be right there. And then right next to it, right there, was going to be an Assassin's Creed poster. And then right, right at the end, there That's would be poster. DC Comics. And they were all going to be the same size and framed and all this. But I'm not going to get an Assassin's Creed one now. Yeah. I found a Destiny one. So I'm going to get Destiny. Destiny. I'm going to have the Destiny one in the middle. And the like DC the original one right cup? Like the regular regular sized ones, like these, I have twenty four by thirty six, dude. Those I I bet you money those are smaller than twenty four by thirty six. Well, this one's they're smaller really than big, one. really tiny. Yeah, like I ordered the the custom oh, Ang one. My it's... Walking Dead one is giant. Yeah, like it there. might be that. Yeah, there we go. It it might be even a little bit bigger, but that looks probably about right but the i ordered the ang one off of ebay and it was 24 by 36 because i read somewhere that that was the standard poster size mm -hmm. and i hang it up on my wall or i unroll it and like lay it on the floor with like four books in the corners to like flatten it out know. yeah and i i look down at it and i'm like this thing is really big yeah, big. yeah. it's really 24 by 36 is really big so it's i've weird. been Trying on to the find ground, one they're thing. giant, but then you put them up and you're just like, yeah, yeah, yeah. there's a poster and it's not that. <laughs> it's st it's still really big. Like I bet if I put it up, it, it would look really, really yeah. big. Like it's, it's it would take big. up a lot of space. But um, once I find a cheap DC Comics 
poster that isn't just Batman or isn't just Superman or is like I found one the other day that was Justice League, but it was like old Justice League and it wasn't New 52. And the thing is, is like I could get old Justice League, but that's that doesn't mean anything to me. I actually read some of the New 52, so I, I, I really would rather have that. So I can't find a good cheap one that's just DC Comics, not just one character and 24 by 36. I'm a little picky, so it'll, it'll be a while. It'll be a while. But <laughs> once I find that, man, three of those up there is going to look awesome. Yeah. I don't know how I got on that tangent. Uh, I don't know. Entertainment? Yeah, yeah, that uh, definitely. Definitely. <laughs> so, uh, Sledgehammer may release something pretty, you know when uh, Bungie originally after like a week of the, no, it was, <laughs> it was after the beta. They released a graphic that was like, this many people played Destiny at this many at this amount of time. Our highest mm-hmm. amount was like eight hundred thousand. It was higher than Halo, Halo Reach, blah blah blah. It was all this, and uh, Sledgehammer basically did the same thing. I bet that Activision. My bet is that Activision saw that that became a news story because it did, and then they were like, "Ooh, we should do this for Call of Duty." So they released mm-hmm. one for Call of Duty: Advanced Warfare, which, by the way, you know how. Before Ghosts, every Call of Duty had, like, just mountains of sales over the previous one. Right. But then it got to Ghosts, and it was like, no, we're going back yeah. down. So, but back in, and even if, I, even Black Ops 2 was, was less. But mm-hmm. Advanced Warfare just toppled over every Call of Duty, every, like, all of them. So, it's, yep. it's, it's big again. It all, the, all the squeakers like playing. The difference, so. Yeah. Different team playing. Yeah, the, the exosuit makes it very different. And honestly, I wanted it because I saw people playing it with the exosuit, and I'm like, this looks really fun. <laughs> so I got it, this and it is. It's been awesome. So yeah, yeah, it is. I just am obsessed with Destiny. <laughs> but yeah. yeah, so I don't know. Let me let me see if I can zoom in on this. Open and somehow in. Ryan has the time to <laughs> prestige in that. Yeah, how – how, right how, I don't know. We should, no. we should somehow look up his character and see how many uh, – how how <laughs> yeah how many hours he has in the game and how many uh, prestiges he does gosh. So let's see yeah okay mm-hmm. player. even though he plays enough to level up his last word maxed like, that's <laughs> ridiculous no yeah. it says 125 plus million people 125 plus million players um players have <laughs> See, this is more of a fun one than, like, flaunting how many actual people were mm-hmm. playing it. This is more of a fun one, like, 16.1 billion boost jumps, uh, 230 trips to the moon from the Earth is the distance jumped with the exosuits wow. titled. 230 trips to the moon from the Earth. <laughs> That's huh. cool. Players have earned over 1.0 quadrillion XP. <laughs> quadrillion. That is insane. Uh, 285 million pieces of loot. Um, wait, wait. <laughs> yeah, then it says this is more than 230 pieces of loot received per second. Huh. Yeah, a lot of people are playing the game. A lot of people are playing it. It's I don't I, I don't know I don't have anything against it. It's good. You get loot from like when you you get the supply jobs from dying. You I, I mean, swear you I get it more often when I die than anything else. <laughs> I've you die. Never I've never gotten it from otherwise. So. Yeah, you die, and then it's like boom. <laughs> it, it's Congratulations. Like, yeah, I guess I did something. Uh, maybe good. it's a tactic so they don't leave, uh, the 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 game. So they won't rage quit. It's like, oh, I died. Oh, I got a supply drop. Yeah. <laughs> maybe I bet they probably still get the um, the supply drop anyways. Maybe I don't know that if they don't, then that's a good strategy, I guess. Yeah. So, mate, I'm actually I'm gonna use the Call of Duty app, and I'm gonna look Ryan's uh, <laughs> character up, and oh. see how many hours he has in the game. You should go ahead and talk about the big topic. It's sort of big. Uh, of... Arrow Flash. <laughs> no, the other one. Uh, well, the the more Arrow serious Flash. one. And then we could be serious for the rest. Yeah, I don't know. I kind of want to end on a happy note. Okay. Okay. Arrow and the Flash. You know. All right. Gosh, I have so many opinions on this. I've been following uh, this um, Ferguson stuff, and now it's it's honestly blown out of proportion as of now. Hmm. Uh, honestly, this should have been 
dealed with with dealed. like maybe a week or two, but no, um, I. I've seen so many like videos and opinions on this thing, it's ridiculous. Um, but honestly, first of all, the people who are putting this on uh, on race are idiots. <laughs> this is nothing about race. So. Um. And race cards. This bye -bye. is interesting. I I have not heard your opinion. I I guess I have my own. So. Yeah. I don't know that that was still dancing around your opinion of it. What like yeah. I don't know the do you do you think okay let's let's just start with this. Do you think the the ruling on the um the oh, cop yeah was was correct? Um, I eyes. think he should have gotten a trial just so people would be feel better about it and see that every all the higher ups can clear him and. How can I say this? Um, just for, in terms of fairness, I don't know. But I mean, I'm not. Ex I'm not upset by it. I'm not gonna lose sleep over it. <coughs> it's just me, but I'm gonna have a coffee. <laughs> You're dying over there, mate. Oh my gosh. You really were. You slowly like deteriorated with that on. cough. You were like, uh. and then you're like. <laughs> and then your face turned really red. And, uh, oh my gosh, that went uh, downhill really quickly. Yeah. Anyway. My goodness, dude. <laughs> it's gonna be all right. <laughs> uh, take a drink and then choke on more water. I hate it when you choke on water. Like that. That's oh, that's yeah. the worst thing ever. Like I I I should of Google that. What? Why does that happen? I should Google that sometime. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe you just swallow it too quickly or something or. Maybe. I don't know. <clears throat> I always thought that it was like you swallowed it the wrong way, if that's even possible. That yeah. was always my theory, but it's the worst. Mm -hmm. Anyways, so the way you were saying your like original thing made me sound like you didn't even think that he was innocent, and I was like, uh, mate. What? So, <laughs> so yeah. I, oh whole, no, I yeah. I think personally, I. I think, but no one actually knows. Only the dead body and the officer knows what actually happened. Yeah, that's but, why. At this point, can... eyewitnesses are just void because one of them uh, lied, and then we don't know if the other ones are telling the truth. Yeah. <clears throat> so pretty much, what it seems like, and from what I've seen, from the facts that I I've seen, and from the autopsies. It sounds like there was a struggle at the car, and if there was at all, then I think there's a good reason for him to stop yeah. him. Mm -hmm. Yeah. With any means. Yeah. You should. I. I. Him. Yeah. I think the majority of this crap is people literally waiting for an excuse. Yeah. To get free stuff. That you know? too. And that's so that's ham. most of these people that are looting. They don't even care yeah. about brown or anything. Yeah. I mean, maybe a small majority of it. The people that are burning down places, they are the people that are like the extremists that are supporting. Yeah. Brown. I'm not sure many stealing I don't are know. just opportunists trying to get what they can. I'm not what. sure even many people at all think that this. Maybe I'm completely wrong, but I don't think very many people even really think that this is a race thing. Yeah. Like, it's just yeah, – because the thing be is, is if you think it's a race thing, you're not going to get it solved by doing what you're doing there. Right. It's not going to – it's just not. It's not going to be solved. Do it doesn't so, do anything. And even if it is a race thing, what does that have to do with anything? How is that going to solve the case? How is – I don't know, dude. It's completely stupid, and I feel like it'll blow over in, in a, in a, even a couple of weeks. I hope so because it's, people it's... are losing their jobs. Yeah. Well, if they're losing their jobs, well, okay, you're talking about people who are losing their jobs because of the From stores. 
Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I thought you were talking about people were losing their jobs because they came into they didn't come into work because they were busy looting. And I was uh, like, those people know, deserve those to have their jobs. Have lost. jobs. Yeah. They're on welfare. True. 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 <laughs> Probably. I mean, yeah. I mean, we're just uh, people spouting opinions on things that we don't fully know about. Yeah. We don't know all the facts, but we're gonna talk about it. Yeah. Because that's that's how it works. <laughs> the rooting. The the rooting. The rooting. <laughs> uh, the rioting is just uncalled for, and. So. Freaking rooting! I imagine them like I, I imagine that as routing. So they're routing. just all sitting at a computer yeah. rerouting. <laughs> Like <laughs> I don't even know. They're all just like configuring their networks. Felicity, reroute us to the nearest. <laughs> <laughs> wow, no. So, oh, so, oh, beautiful segue. Let's uh, let's let Felicity segue. segue us into the next topic, oh, yeah. which is Felicity as a segue and the Flash. What was yeah, it? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, but Arrow and the Flash crossover. It's happening, dude. It's happening on Tuesday. Two days. Yeah. Two freaking Starting days. With Flash, and it's gonna be awesome. I think. I think what's the Flash episode is gonna be them all being buddy buddy, working together, talking, and all that stuff. And then stuff's gonna go down, and then then it's gonna continue on until the next episode where they're like fighting and crap. Yeah. I don't <laughs> think so. Yeah. I don't. I don't know if you. I've watched a bunch of the um, interviews with the cast and stuff, and they've said a couple right. uh, a bit about what it what it is i guess you can say or what they are trying to or they've, they've said a little bit about the general plot so basically barry says that something happens where barry like loses his mind so called so huh. like he could I, I don't know i feel like he's going to be either killing people or something i hope not that would be pretty rough uh. but he's gonna be probably doing doing some damage he's gonna be doing mm -hmm. some damage and mm -hmm. Arrow's gonna have to come to Central City to stop him, and then there's gonna be Flash versus Arrow. Oh my gosh! Oh, yeah. and then the 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 or, I mean, I I'm not splitting this perfectly into two sections, but I'm saying two main sections. It might not be half and half, but two main sections are gonna be that, and then them both teaming up after that, trying to take down whoever is okay, yeah. the main villain, which I'm still not sure. Captain Boomerang, probably. <laughs> boomerang and i'm i don't know i'm sure they have oh my goodness boomerang and zoom dude zoom is actually confirmed to like be in these episodes oh. i'm pretty sure he he might not be in much of them but he's confirmed to be in them so huh. that he might be oh well also episode nine is supposed to be the big reverse flash yeah. episode like grant gustin called it that once and yeah. i was like oh my gosh that sounds awesome so i'm yeah. Ooh, baby. <laughs> oh, my gosh. It's going to be, so... be so good. I am I love that show so much. <laughs> so, Nate just typed in the the, the uh, conversation saying, if you have not watched Walking Dead, do not look at the Walking Dead Facebook page. It ruined the episode. Oh, no. GG. No. No, dude. You know, I saw that, too. I saw when I got off and I opened Facebook, I saw the Walking Dead's page, and it just said, uh, rest peace, Beth. And I was like, "GG" to anyone who didn't see the episode. Yeah, but I was like, all the comments were like, "Wow, wow, just wow." <laughs> good job, but good job, Thanks, AMC. AMC. <laughs> My guess. You could have waited at least twenty-four hours. On yeah, I, I would think waited. I would but think. I think the reason they did that is because um, most people do watch well, it live. That's the thing. yeah. It's like the most watched live thing, yeah. and they're like trying, you know. Yeah, they're trying to push more people to watch it live. Yeah. So maybe they just put that out knowing, really? and they're like... A clever, clever AMC. <laughs> yeah, they put it out knowing so that may next time they'll be like, we need to watch that live. So that that doesn't happen. Yeah, I bet, I bet Nate's not going to miss an episode now, is he? Yeah. <laughs> uh, I refreshed the page of this, uh, page of the spoilers pop-up. <laughs> Poor Nate. Dang. That well, he should have watched it. He should be playing Destiny with us. He should be doing many things, but he's, you know, working and having a job, making money. It's time for walking Dead. Walking. Why? Why British all of a sudden, mate? Why? 
<laughs> oh, so do you know what what uh, area or time period? No, not time period. Do you know what area the uh, the spinoff is taking place in? I don't know. I heard it once, uh, but I forgot. Oh, of what? Wait, what? Area of the world. Area of the world. Yes. For what? The the Walking Dead spinoff, oh, like I just said. I never. Heard, I didn't know there was a spinoff. I heard like talking about it, and this no one. Oh. Way. Oh. I haven't been looking into oh, it. Oh, okay. I, I thought you might know. I'm going to guess it's in Nicaragua. I think it's in, if I remember correctly, I think it's still in America. Oh, well, yeah. Which I kind of think is stupid, but that's okay. Anyway, um, I, don't, I, don't, I thought you would know that. I don't, I don't know why I thought I'm you gonna, would know that, but I did, so I just threw that out I'm there. I'm going to guess maybe it's going to be in New York or Texas. New York or Texas. Uh, I... Th- Mm, New York would be interesting, actually. Yeah, lots of walkers. Oh my gosh, New York. What's what's that? Uh, isn't it like Rhode Island or something? There's a city that's like really small, but has like the more population than like yeah. Texas. It's one of those up there, like. <laughs> yeah, Rhode they're Island. screwed. That's it, where the herds come from. Right. That's where the herds come from. They all Main just cities and all that. Yeah, but uh, I don't know why I just brought that up. Anyways. Freaking, so next, next, or this upcoming week is Arrow the Flash. Um, let's see, uh, Flash on Tuesday, or on uh, Wednesday, but it's basically two parts of the crossover. Do you think Thanksgiving um, our show is about to leave? Yeah, yeah. Um, okay. there should be a new South Park this week. There wasn't one last week. Let's see. Uh, after that, Cora's on Friday. Mm-hmm. Cora's That's on gonna Friday. That's going to be a good episode, too. Cora was awesome, by the way. That's where poop gets real. Poop. Quoting Brian. <laughs> I I like I like the Cora episode. I always like the Cora episode. I mean, not tons happen, but I don't know. I just love Cora and the universe, and it's awesome. Dude, have you seen the preview for next week? Mm, I guess not. Oh, <laughs> I thought oh. I did. Well, Toph's gonna be in it, so. Oh, I saw. It images that's not a preview oh yeah okay okay you mean the two images yeah i saw those (laughs) no i didn't mean the two two images there's a video is that an actual video oh okay no i did not see the video i saw pictures of the video i guess i'll have to go look that up immediately but um it's funny so yeah friday's cora uh after that constantine on saturday Mm -hmm. um no Walking Friday. Ted next Sunday. So GG. I'm gonna try yeah, Constantine Friday. Constantine live from now on because yeah. GL bro. I still haven't watched the two episodes on Hulu. I have two episodes backlogged. Do it. <laughs> I I don't know. But uh I'll I'll do it eventually. I'll do it eventually. But uh let's see. Um there really aren't that many big games coming out in the next uh I can think of couple of weeks, but- are there? I'll tell you the now. cruise still has the crew is still coming out soon. Well, yeah. that's about it, I think. Um, 2015 is going to be a great year for games. I know that this year was very rocky with games glitching out like Halo and Unity and all that stuff, and this other titles not living up to expectations. A lot of people didn't like Destiny. Uh, you know, kind of. I don't agree with anyone who says this year was a bad year for games. I don't. No, I don't either because I liked all but the games. But then again, I am a bit biased because I'm not sure I've ever considered one year a bad year for games since I've started playing games. I'm pretty yeah. sure I, I've, I've never. Well, okay. In... A lot of people don't like the games that we like, so, I mean, you know. Well, screw them. <laughs> they're, they're never going to be happy in life. Yeah, <laughs> they're never gonna be happy with their with their games. They they really aren't. The people who like Destiny were looking for something specific. The people who like yeah. didn't like Watch Dogs were looking for something specific. It was, mm-hmm. I don't know, preset notions. Right. I mean, and stupidity and people who have never played the game voicing opinions that they don't actually have. They're just being trolls. That is also a yeah. thing. So. True. I I I think this year was a great year for games. It it was a little bit rocky in recently of, um, but i still think the games were great and once i mean issues. yeah 
once it's all fixed, this year will have been a great year. <laughs> the two main ones were Unity and the Master Chief Collection. Yeah, but the Master Chief Collection is, from what I've heard, getting better. And mm-hmm. Unity just released the, released the third patch that should fix a lot of stuff. And that mm-hmm. happened today. Actually, um, or a couple of days ago. that had some problems was The Evil Within. Really? Um, I didn't hear that had any problems. I wasn't really looking into it. I've been just watching people play it on YouTube. And um, it's really good. The game is good, but like it was locked at 30 FPS for every console and and PC, and PC. So everyone was like really upset about that. So what what they did? They took off the the cap, the 30 FPS cap, and the, the game also had like letterboxing on mm. top and bottom. Yeah. So they took that off too. So people <laughs> complain about that. One. Like, yeah, that's too. that's weird. Game developers have done some weird stuff this year. That that's, that's right. what it is. That's also, what World it is. Warcraft, some weird stuff. When Warlords came oh, out. Oh yeah, that was a bit. All the weird. servers were getting. You know, you're right. I think games right. this year were great, but the thing is, is that games this year had problems. Had <laughs> tech problems. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. That, that, that that's a bummer. Good. Yeah, Warlords. That's insane that they haven't that they didn't hold that up. Blizzard is one of the studios that i hold as like i i still hold even though i'm not a fan of blizzard as i am of other games i still hold blizzard as like the top studio that makes games right now Mm -hmm. um i hold blizzard is number one and naughty dog is number two and i had a third but i forget it now i had a third i don't even know but um i hold those two up there and it's insane that blizzard couldn't uh hold up with that i guess they weren't expecting it i I mean i think Okay, in the past, the people they've been getting hit with DDoS attacks as well. Yeah. Like, um, what was it last weekend? I could not log in the World of Warcraft for nothing. So mm. Oh, also, been... dude, we should point out. I don't know. I'm like hugging the camera right now. Ooh, I'm shadows. <laughs> shadows. Oh, snap. Too far. Oh, autofocus. Thank you. Um, <laughs> the uh, the new Summoner's Rift is apparently, if I'm not incorrect. I think it's out now. Yeah, just, I've, it is. I've seen, okay, yeah. Um, I mean, check. it was out on the it was out on the oh. test servers for a while. I know that specifically, but I don't know if it's out. I I think I heard, but I didn't look into it for a full fact. But I think it's out now, and if it's not, it'll be out for season five pretty soon. So that's a thing. We should jump back on and play a game of league and record it and upload that. <laughs> that would be fun. Yeah, that would. But the new Summoner's Rift is really interesting, even though I, I, I think it it's gonna give me an excuse to go back on and play like two games, and then I'm done with that again. I can't stop playing Destiny. After I get off, I'm, uh, I can't. I have to render this. <laughs> GG. I have to edit and render it. Oh well. But uh, yeah. I mean that's mainly it. Uh, I just wanted to point out the all the games coming out, which mainly most of them are already out. The Crew is coming yeah. out soon. Uh have you played it? I played the beta. Um, yeah. Is beta still open? No, it was a re- it was seriously like a day and a half beta. They they <laughs> opened it at night, and then they had the whole day the next day, and then it was gone. <laughs> they uh, so it was really quick. Um, I I don't think there's much else really. I mean, lots of stuff has come out, but I don't think much else is coming out in the near future. No. Yeah, thanks. Thanks for watching, I guess. We'll be back next Sunday. Um, oh, let's do – you know what? Let's look at the calendar right now. Let's plan some things. Oh, frick. I just opened my calculator instead of my calendar, GG. Um, calendar. All right. Next Sunday is the 7th. Okay. Okay. I'll be here for next Sunday. We can do it next Sunday. But freaking – um. Oh my gosh, I just realized something. What? Holy crap. I have an idea. Okay, so next Sunday we'll be we'll be here and it'll be like normal. But on the but for the Sunday or for the Monday of the 15th, which is going to be when the whole trip is happening and stuff, when I'm going to see you and then going to Montgomery and all sorts of stuff. Hmm. So, I think me, you and Ryan should like somehow sit down and just record us in a room, you know? Hmm. That would be hard to do, though. 
like it would work because we would be there the Friday, but it would be really hard to do because we would all need our own mics and stuff. So I don't think that'll happen. Yeah. But uh, unless you brought your mic, I could. Hmm. How many how many USB ports do you have available on your computer though? That's the question. A See, lot. mine mine are literally all full. I don't know how they're all full, and I I have ports too. I have extra ones that like you yeah, plug yeah, them yeah. in and it's four. There you go. Yeah. yeah, they're awful. What? They're awful. I, okay. Tons of crap back in there. But um, I have, I you have, have a bunch? Up, I have four up on the top of my computer and then like four in the back of my computer. So All I'm right. Good. Well, maybe we'll do that then. I can have Ryan bring his Turtle Beach and I, I, I could bring this and just like hold it. Yeah. Just talk into it like a, like a rock star. But uh, <laughs> or yeah. Like, yeah. We can either do that and record it the Friday of, and I can have you edit and, and I can, <laughs> yeah, I can have, yeah, yeah, I can have you edit and upload it and stuff, uh, so that it's out on the Monday, and then, uh, pff, we could, or I was thinking you could, if you wanted to, you could like host one yourself with you and Andrew, <laughs> while me and Ryan are gone, or we could just do it. Uh, in advance, pretty in advance. We could do a special thing like you know, uh, have it scheduled to go up or something. Yeah, we could. Yeah, we. Could I, I think it would be cool to have us in the same room. Just yeah, talking. that would be cool. Like, you guys, you watch the the um, the rocket jump people. Yeah, yeah, like, I know. Podcast. The best podcasts are podcast. I'm 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 outing us right now. Exposed. <laughs> the best podcasts are the podcasts with people in the same room. Like the internet thing is just makes it a little bit worse because of delay and stuff, but uh, yeah. But the and like if it's all going into one thing going into the computer, you don't have to worry about interrupting someone. So like if if I inter er, like say we had it doesn't work uh, now the way it's set up, but say like we had three people on and like you interrupted like Andrew then it, you guys' sound would both be so mixed that you couldn't hear it. If we were in the same room, it would both be going to one source so that you could just hear it perfectly. Right. But, um, yeah, we might do that. We could do it either Thursday night when – no, we're not doing it Thursday night. We could do it with me and you on Wednesday and just do something uh, special there. But then again, we're, we're playing Destiny. We'll figure it out. That's two weeks from yeah. now. Next week will be fine. Long tangent, short, uh, cut short. We're we're just rambling on now. Uh, Merry early Christmas, Happy Thanksgiving. That was pretty recent. That was last week. Hopefully, you had a good time with eating mm -hmm. your your turkeys and your stuffing and all sorts of stuff. So uh, yeah, remember to do your dailies every day. And uh, Eric, what do you have for us today? Your random item. Um. Oh yeah. <laughs> Eggnog. Eggnog. Drink it. Drink it all up. Yeah. Yeah. That was, that was really creepy. Eggnogs are eggnogs are good.